Look at these amazing animated videos. Would you believe they were created using AI and free tools? Yes, you heard that right. In this tutorial, I'll show you step by step how to make stunning 3D animations like these. Yet you don't need expensive software, advanced skills, or hours of effort. By the end of this video, you'll know how to create your own viral and monetizable animations, even if you're a total beginner. Whether you want to create a magical children's story, a short film, or fun videos for social media, this tutorial has everything you need. So grab your favorite drink, get comfortable, and let's dive in. Let me give you a quick preview of what we'll cover in this tutorial. We'll guide you through the entire process of creating AI-powered animations, step by step. First, we'll start by using ChatGPT to craft a structured and detailed story script. This is crucial, because having a clear narrative will ensure your animation flows smoothly from start to finish. Once the script is ready, we'll move on to generating stunning images for each scene using Leonardo AI, a free and easy-to-use tool. I'll show you how to ensure character consistency across your scenes by using a simple trick in the settings. After we've got all our images, we'll bring them to life by turning them into dynamic animations using powerful free animation tools. You'll learn how to input animation prompts and adjust timing to create smooth transitions between scenes. Then we'll add voiceovers using a free text-to-speech tool, enhancing your animation with narration that suits the tone of your story. Finally, we'll edit everything together in a video editing tool, adding sound effects and background music to create a polished and professional result. By the end of this tutorial, you'll be ready to create your own viral monetizable animations, even if you're a complete beginner. Now let's start the process. First of all, we need to do is create a story using ChatGPT. Don't worry, I've already prepared a special prompt for you to make this easy. All you need to do is open ChatGPT and paste the prompt I'll provide in the description below. Once you paste the prompt, just enter your story title and hit the button to generate the script. ChatGPT will instantly start generating the story for you, and it will provide both the narration for the script and the prompts for the images you'll need to create. One thing to keep in mind when using AI-generated images is character consistency. If your character appears in multiple scenes, it's important that they look the same throughout the entire animation. Once the script is generated, take some time to review it carefully and make sure the story flows well. If anything needs to be changed or adjusted, feel free to edit it as needed. With your story script ready, you've completed the first step. Now it's time to move on to the next part, generating stunning images that bring your story to life. In the next step, we'll create amazing images for each part of your story. To do this, we'll use an AI image generator called Leonardo AI. It's easy to use and can create high-quality pictures for free. The best part is, it helps keep the characters looking the same in every scene. Let me show you how to do it step by step. First, search for Leonardo AI on Google and click on the first website that appears. When you're on the site, you'll see a cool dashboard. Click the Get Started button, and you'll need to make an account by entering your email. After signing up, log in, and you'll see the great interface of Leonardo AI. On the dashboard, you'll find various options, but for now, click on Image Generation to move to the next step. The first thing you'll need to do is select the aspect ratio of the image. We'll use the 6-9 aspect ratio, which is the standard size for YouTube. You can leave the other settings unchanged. On the right side of the screen, you'll find a prompt box where you will enter the prompt that was generated by ChatGPT. This is where you'll input the description for each scene, and the AI will generate images based on the script. In Leonardo AI, you'll get 150 free coins every day, which should be enough for creating images for your story. Once you hit the Generate button, the tool will process and provide you with the images. After some time, you'll see the results. This is where you'll be amazed by how impressive and realistic the images are, with four variations for each scene. To ensure that the characters remain consistent across different scenes, follow these steps, click on the three dots beside one of the generated images and copy the seed. Then on the right side of the interface, click on Advanced Settings and enable the Seeds option. Pass the seed you copied earlier and hit Generate again. This ensures that the character remains the same throughout all the images. And repeat this process for all the scenes in your story. Once all the images are generated, save them in a well-organized folder so they're easy to access for the next steps in the animation process. With your images ready, you've already completed a big part of the animation process. Now, it's time to bring those images to life and turn them into moving animations. This step will change your still images into exciting, dynamic scenes that will keep your audience interested. To do this, we will use an animation tool like Minimax AI or Hue AI. These tools are great for creating smooth and professional animations from your images. Start by logging into the animation tool of your choice. If you don't have an account yet, you can easily sign up for a free plan, which usually allows you to make a few videos per day. Once you're logged in, click the Upload button and add all the images you've made for your story. Make sure to upload them in the correct order according to your script. After uploading your images, the next step is to add animation prompts for each image. These prompts should be simple and clear, 
explaining what action or mood you want in each scene. You can use the image prompts that ChatGPT gave you to help with this. Once you've added your animation prompts, click Generate to start creating the animations. After the animations are ready, take some time to preview them. If you see any small issues, fix them to make sure everything looks just right. When you're happy with the result, export the video clips. Be sure to export them in the best quality possible to make your final video look professional. Sometimes you might face some challenges. For example, the animation could be too short or too long compared to your script. If this happens, you can adjust the timing or add remove frames to make it match the flow of the script. With these small changes, you'll have a dynamic animated video that brings your story to life. Now that your animations are ready, the next step is to add voiceovers and narration to make your story more engaging. This will help bring your animation to life and make it more interesting for viewers. For this, we will use a free tool called ClipChamp. To start, search for ClipChamp on Google and click on the first website that comes up. Once you're on the website, you will see a dashboard. Click on the Try for Free button, and then you will need to create an account by entering your email. After signing up, log in and you'll see the ClipChamp dashboard. Now, click on the Text-to-Speech option. This will open a new section, and on the left side, you will see the option Text-to-Speech. Click on it, and a new box will appear on the right side. Here you will see a prompt box where you can enter the narration you want to use for your voiceover. Start by copying the narration parts from the story script you made earlier. Pass them into the text box in ClipChamp. Then, pick a voice that matches the feel of your story. For example, if you're making a children's animation, choose a friendly and happy voice. ClipChamp gives you different voice options so you can try a few to see which one works best for your project. Now that your animations and voiceovers are ready, it's time to put everything together in the final editing process. This step involves putting your video clips together, matching the audio, and adding extra touches like sound effects and music to make your video look and sound great. Start by adding all your animation clips and voiceover audio to a video editing tool. CapCut is a great free tool for this because it's easy to use and has everything you need. Arrange your video clips in the right order according to your script. Then, match the voiceover to each scene by dragging the audio files onto the editing timeline and lining them up with the video clips. If the voiceover is a bit too short or long for a clip, change the speed of the video clip to make sure it fits perfectly. Next, make your video even better with sound effects and background music. Sound effects help make your scenes feel more real. To add these, just drag the audio files into the editing timeline and place them where they should go. Make sure the sound effects and music are not too loud so the voiceover can still be heard clearly. Use fade in and fade out to make the sound changes smoother between scenes. These little details will improve how your video feels and make it look more professional. Once your video is fully edited, watch it one last time to make sure everything looks and sounds right. Make any final changes if needed, so everything flows smoothly from start to finish. When you're happy with it, export the video in the best quality possible so it looks great when you share it on places like YouTube, Instagram, or TikTok. Congratulations, your AI-powered animated video is now complete. From crafting a story to generating animations, adding voiceovers and final editing, you've successfully created a captivating piece of content. If you found this tutorial helpful, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and share it with others who might find it useful. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on more tutorials like this one. I'd love to see what you've created, so feel free to share your videos or ideas in the comments below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next views. And